Hi Psychic America, this is Tracy Brown coming to you today. Oh dear, oh wait, June 27, June 27, 2014. How are you? Um, today I'm going to do a reading. Actually I had several readings to do and then I thought about them all and then I can't remember any of them. In any case, I'm just having brain freeze right now. But in any case, Today I'm going to do Jennifer Aniston, Aniston, Jennifer Aniston. Now, Jennifer, I really, really like you. I really do. I think you're one of the funniest Lucille Ball type of actresses I've ever seen. But a modern day version so that nobody really compares you to Lucille Ball. But I totally see that in you. You are an amazing, amazingly funny actress. Whether you do a serious role or... A comedic role you come out like amazing and I've seen most of your movies um, with that being said um, there's something about you that's not um, that's off there's something about you that's off and so I'm, I'm looking at your dating history and I've always always wondered if, if you know if you were ever gonna get married like ever you're one of the prettiest girls I've, I've ever seen. I love your eyes. I love your soft face. Um, but you're having trouble. You're just having trouble. And uh, today, Jennifer, you're up for Psychic Review. I'm going to see if you're going to ever, ever get married. I think you deserve it. Um, hey, guys, if you want to reach me, which I'm getting so busy. Thank you. Thank you, because I'm getting so busy. But you can reach me at 818 985-2010, or the greenmanstore.com, um, and if you want to come in, I'm in North Hollywood, California, so all those that live here, come in. Anybody else, call me. <laughs> but everybody else, please subscribe to my YouTube channel, and more importantly, damn it, more importantly, please join me on Twitter. At Pop Culture Psychic. Psychic is spelled P S Y C K. Or just Google me. If you Google Tracy Brown Twitter, it'll show up. So, Jennifer, will you ever get married? Ever get married? Jennifer? Jennifer? Answer this question. Jesus, give me pray. Jennifer, will you ever get married? Ugh, it's one of those times I don't get my answer. Ugh, Jennifer, what is what is wrong with you? Ugh, Jennifer, 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 why am I not getting my answer? Um, maybe I'm asking the wrong question. You know, I asked if Jennifer would ever get married, right? And by the way, guys, I've done this before, you know? You know, I've looked into whether or not Candy Burgess and Todd would ever get married. The cards were clear, like, yes. Not getting that with Jennifer, to be honest with you. Maybe I was in my mind thinking, will she ever marry this guy? I think in my mind I had that. The question was, will she ever get married? Um, okay, here's, here's my problem with you, Jennifer. And I could be wrong, I just don't think I am. I think you have some daddy issues. You know, that you pushed under the table. I think they started when you were really young, three, four, five. I don't think you ever, ever recovered from that. I'm going to check on the internet to see who your family history is. I don't think you have famous parents, but you definitely have some daddy issues that you're not dealing with. There's a big sacrifice that you need, like a come-to-Jesus moment maybe some therapy, like serious therapy, not therapy where the therapist pampers you. I mean, real therapy where you're like getting like, like th because this is what you want. Um, I think there was some sabotage when you were a kid. I don't know what your history is like. I think there was some sabotage. I think you came out of the sabotage by becoming a star. 
So you never really had to look at yourself. I think you have some daddy issues, which means um, being in a relationship, because you're not dealing with your daddy issues, I, I don't think you ever stay in a relationship. Um, you know, I keep getting so much needs to be worked on you. You're a beautiful, beautiful girl. First thing I said in a reading, but if you notice this guy's clothing, like, he's broken. But in the front, you can't see it. It looks like he's a hard worker. That's you, Jennifer. The card above it is the Five of Pentacles. You know, you don't know <coughs> that um, you have daddy issues. You have daddy issues. Um... You know, are you ever going to get married? I get the temperance card that tells me, not today, definitely not today. <clears throat> I also don't think you found your soulmate yet, whatever that means, because I hate the word soulmate, people. Soulmate is not a word that I like to use, but I'm going to use it in this case because it doesn't really matter. Um, I don't think you've um, found your soulmate yet. Again, I'm back to some past life issues. Not past life in another life. I mean past life, you know, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Um, I think you keep dating stars, and I think the guy that's going to come to you is not going to be in a business. I know you're dating right now. I get it, but I just get the feeling that you guys are going to put the brakes on. I just don't get it. Marriage is definitely going to come to you, but, you know, maybe not for a couple of years after you've done some work on yourself. Oh, Jennifer. This is going to be a short reading because I'm not even going to go into details. The man that you're going to be involved with, I feel like definitely is going to be legal, law, legal, law, accounting. You know, I'm going to add that. Law, fireman, cop, law, something like that. Um, I don't think he's going to have as much money as you, but when he shows up, I don't think it's going to matter. I think you're going to get it. You're going to finally get, like, this guy has shown up for love for you. But he's a qualified valuable man other than the stars that you've been dating so I'm just going to end it here I feel really sad about this Jennifer I think you're suffering I think you're suffering a lot and I think this needs to end for you alright guys it's Psychic Tracy Brown got a reading so I gotta get up out of here thank you for tuning in and um, third eye view later on today take it easy bye